Uh, first of all, it is uh, quite laughable that I am being given directions to State House <laughs> as a senator of Nairobi by somebody from Mugirang. <laughs> uh, Osoro. I know every inch of this city. I have covered it, and that's why you saw me getting those numbers that the uh, brother was talking about there in the election. When I get lost in Mugirango, I will call you, because I know you understand that area very well. Number two, tell your president to stop barricading himself in State House if he wants us to come there, because why is he hiding behind the police? He has told us that we should face him mundo and this other uh, pseudo Mau Mau who calls himself a child of Mau Mau. Uh, he's hiding behind the police. If Rigathi can just come in front of the police to receive our petition, we'll be very happy. Remove the police, we will come into a KICC, we will do uh, our dance around the statue of Kenyatta the way we were doing the other time and we were tear gassed. Remove the police from uh, uh, the, the, the barricades. Even today, you yourself have seen, when we've come into the studio, they wake up very early to put barricades to State House. These are people who are cowards. They are hiding behind the police. I want to address this question of a notice. That, that is we, a have not seen, yes, okay. we have not seen <coughs> the OCS for Kilimani here. We have not seen him standing up before the press saying, I have not received a notice, or that he is banning protest. The people who are making these unconstitutional pronouncements are Bungay and the IG of police. So when we serve the police stations, and I want to confirm here that in fact every single police station in Nairobi has been served with a notification of protests. This exercise of the rights under Article 37 caused some inconveniences. Again, as a senator of Nairobi, I want to uh, give you an example. We have events here which don't happen in Mugirango, like uh, uh, we have bike races, we have marathons. They cause inconveniences. They cause road closures. The exercise of political rights have some consequences. You cannot say, oh, your rights begin where mine end. No. These are political rights, and the way we give life to political rights is to exercise them. Are you? The purpose of uh, notification of police is to invite them to protect or to provide security for the protesters. But we have, in our experience, realized it doesn't matter how much we can comply with the law. We have complied with the law, the Public Order Act, Article 37. They are still going to unconstitutionally declare our protests illegal. So what we have done, we are no longer going to issue notices. Let us exercise our right under Article 37. Protests will happen spontaneously, anywhere, anytime, without any notification to the police because we have realized that the notifications are no longer invitations for them to provide security, but they are an invitation for them to visit violence on us. There is a rule when we were in law school, and these brothers of mine understand, it's called the but for rule. <clears throat> that without which this cannot happen. But for this, this would not happen. I am telling you, but for police action, this protest will be peaceful. Remove police action. Remove police action from these things. And you will see, our people will come to town. They will dance at KICC the way we came to Uru Park to swear in Baba. We will say whatever it is we want to say because we have the freedom of speech. Okay. The freedom of speech is not limited by me. I can insult you under my freedom of speech. The only limitation to freedom of speech is propaganda for war. They know it. Hey incitement to violence, but me using an unpleasant language to you is protected under the Constitution. I don't have to please your ears or sorrow. Okay. But I, I, am, I, am, I am protected under this Constitution to use the <coughs> words. When I say leo mutatuona, how is, how is that unconstitutional? How is that okay. breaking the law? So Thank for you. us, really, we want to say we will no longer issue these uh, notices because and they have no they, purpose. They, they'll do they love, no, so now you can do whatever it is you want to do. On the question of uh, the UDA office in uh, yeah, Kisumu, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I, again, as a senator of Nairobi, I have a predecessor here. Uh, his name is Michael, Mike Sonko. He himself confessed in public that, in fact, these are tactics they used against opposition protests. They would get old cars, ban them, and then say, oh, this is uh, ODF. No, 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 no. you can't really use He confessed. Okay. But okay. you can't Baba, Baba, you have, you, No, no, just authority. a minute. Thank you. Just a minute. Oh, so what I am saying I'm, is... I'm, I'm the river what I am I saying is, that position. Yes, what yes, I am I'll hold saying it to account on, on what happened. Just what I'm saying is... Before is you proceed... A, there is a precedent in these things, because okay. the protest in Kisumu is not as if that... In fact, you know you guys... You want me to say things that I shouldn't say on okay. this show. But I'm saying, if I wanted to destroy a house, if I wanted to destroy a house, I can destroy a house. Like you did okay. in I, It was not okay. destroyed. Thank like you. The house was not well, destroyed. Well, 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 like you guys yeah. did these, in Netherlands. Th these are cosmetic things that are arranged there okay. to present. Because the protesters in Kisumu have been going on for a long time. It's not as if that is the only uh, uh, government-owned. Okay. Uh, Senator, I, I understand your point. 
But where does responsibility lie? <coughs> do, do, you, do, do you condemn what happened? Uh, it can't, listen, it can't come yes, listen, of, listen sort of, how, how, why would I not Let's condemn. have some order. I okay. have said here yes. that it is not the aim of protests mm. to destroy anybody's property, to attack private property, to attack anybody during this protest. In fact, the responsibility of the police is to make sure that people who take themselves outside the protection of Article 37 mm -hmm. are brought to book. We have pictures, we have photographs of those people. Arrest them. Okay. And then, when you arrest those people, please, before you blame me, you have to draw a nexus, a connection between their actions and my pronouncements as a political movement. We want, if those people who are, went to Northlands, up to today, nobody has been arrested. Their photographs are all over the newspaper, okay. the social media. But, 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 but the number on. plates of vehicles you know, that were cutting okay. up, they are known. Senator, when know. those people are arrested, okay. ask them whether there is a connection, a nexus between their actions and the things that Before, before the arrests are made, and, and that is uh, a mandate that lies with an agency of government. With the police, yes, okay. so don't ask me. Uh, okay, I made your point. Please. Okay, the asking about is that you are leader in this country. Yes. And you condemn violence for that? I do what, condemn violence. What is Police violence, okay. violence meted out by goons. He I cannot condemn violence. Thank you. I have just condemned it. Okay, he thank is, you. He, I am <laughs> condemning it and you are saying I can't well, condemn it. I am condemning it. We have, can I be allowed to condemn it? Clearly. <laughs> you, 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 and that is the answer that I I'm want. not being allowed to condemn okay. it. I'm condemning it that, and that is shouting. The, that is the answer that I wanted for accountability purposes. I condemn violence in all its forms. Thank you. you know, it is.